What is up? What is good? It's your girl T T. Back in with another video. I was gonna say back in with another channel, but anyways, this video is mainly about care, basically about self care, but mainly about your hair. You know, so a couple of hair cares, basically hair products that I use. If you guys watched before, like I mean, if you knew, hi, my name's Treasure. I'm 21 years old. What's up? Let's get it popping. But my old ones, what's popping? What's good? What's giddy? You know, my oldies that have been watching me, you guys have seen in my old previous videos that um I did dye my hair. If you guys can tell, I did dye it. You guys can see like loose specks, just a little bit. But I dyed my hair twice, and yeah, so and I grew it back. And when I dyed it, the dyeing process, it made, like, my hair was shedding a lot. You know, I was losing, like, a lot of hair, but it wasn't look like I was losing a lot of hair. But my hair was damaged, obviously, from the dye, and I also had heat damage, too. So, that would mix with dye, yeah. Like, I was not really caring for it as much because of the dye and stuff. So, I was like, hey, I got color here, why not, you know, make it look natural in the center like make it look nice it was dyed it was looking nice i was like ooh, but it was a lot of damage though to my hair so i'm gonna show you guys the product of kind of what helped my hair grow and made it look strong and healthy yeah, i had a wash day last week and i see that i don't even have like ends like dead ends like that no more and my dead ends was hanging and i'm gonna just pull up the video right here but i was so hyped that my dead ends was like healthy like how Dennis could be healthy but my ends was healthy if you guys get my drift I'm gonna show you guys what I use like what I use to wash my hair what I do like what kind of products I use for my twist out yeah what I do like do styles like these when I do styles like these what gel I use and it's not third first what kind of hair mask I use so normally the hair mask I use I normally like so right now you know I'm trying out different hair masks and stuff so when I do get a hair mask right I do find hair mask that is very moisturizing for my hair because my hair is really dry so yeah also I think I, I think it's very important to understand your hair too and I think it's also very important what kind of hair texture type you have on like have on your head I think my texture type I'm going to put it on the screen again what kind of hair texture I am, but I, to top of my dome, because I know my hair stylist that do my braids, she did tell me, for a 3C, for a, but if anybody that know hair, I mean, I'll wait, this would count because I did a twist out, but anyways, anyways, yeah, so if you guys have those type of textures, I think these will help you out, if you guys are more like, your curls are more looser and like, your curls are more loose or you have them more wavy or straight tight i don't know so i'm only going for the girls that have my hair so if you got 3c 4a mixture type of hair these are products that will work well for your hair anyways hair mask that i i'm recently using is a deep conditioner hair mask and yeah i can't say the name yes i'm very slow i call it a hair mask it's not it's it's technically a hair mask it's not it's a deep conditioner but I use it as a hair mask. When I normally do hair masks, I do the hair mask when I'm about to do something. Like yesterday, I was cleaning out my refrigerator and I was cleaning my room. So I had this hair mask on for like a good hour and a half, two hours. Put it up in the picture right here so you guys can get the drift. And, you guys, and it's hella cheap. This was like only like two, two dollars. I got this out the 99 cent store, yes. That's why I do the hair mask on to washing and conditioning the hair. When it comes to my hair, right? And it depends what kind of style I do to my hair. So when I'm doing wigs and stuff, I don't get dandruff as much as a lot. So when I don't get dandruff as much, I use the dry scalp care um two in one head and shoulders shampoo. And I always use two in one shampoo because two in one shampoo just helps my hair. Important. Take notes. Always see what your hair is saying. Talk to your hair. And what I mean by talking to your hair is actually getting and touching and see what is wrong, what is the problem. You will always touch and find out what's the problem with your hair. When you understand your hair, you'll know what products is good for your hair. Period. You know, you'll know what your hair is saying. Thank you. When your hair, when it's feeling good, when the scalp feeling good, that's not, that's how you know your hair is responding to you and saying thank you. I'm wearing like braids. 
and box braids, feeding braids, like those type of braids, I'm, I would get hella dandruff because while I have those braids, I'm oiling my hair. When I have braids, I really, really be in depth with my hair of gelling it, this and third. I put grease, I put gel, I put mousse, all that. And I do my edges. So that's a lot of dandruff buildup going together. So when that happens, I take on my braids. I do use this dandruff shampoo, two in one. Yes. Um, Madisa. I think it's Madisa. Like these two from family dollar um these both was like only like three three dollars three four dollars yeah these are the two conditioners i use so let's go with this one this is my favorite um pinterest put me on to this conditioner so when i saw oh my god this came with the conditioner and the shampoo i use it i use that shampoo too sometimes yeah some girl on pinterest recommend me recommended people to get this and stuff so i was like oh why not you know and also the girl that dyed my hair she also used this um the conditioner as well too so i was like oh why not and i kind of like the feeling that it was making my hair go through you know making my fingers go through the hair and stuff this from family dollar so i came with the shampoo and it was on sale for like um twelve dollars original price it would normally come up to like 20 20 18 20 dollars so that was a good steal that was a steal like get the screenshots sweetie get in those screenshots so my next conditioner i use it is a detangler and a conditioning conditioner from cream of nature this so while i was going like um hygiene shopping but i was normally looking for a leave-in conditioner because i ran out of leave-in conditioner and i thought this was a leave-in conditioner so i just grabbed it up and be like oh this is new let me try it so i didn't know this was a conditioner so made it soft all that what a conditioner supposed to do what a conditioner supposed to do it does the job you know I, as i'm um detangling my hair i normally use my fingers to detangle my hair but if it's like too knotted i'm going in with a big tooth comb this should be like a dollar in the beauty supply store while i'm done washing my hair boom, boom, you know getting the junk out my hair let's say i want to blow out my hair do a blowout i don't feel like twisting out my hair right so what i do i grab up a leave-in conditioner i borrowed my mom's leave-in conditioner that she used i like the um let's just say i like the um the progress the process i don't know but the texture i like is a cream texture so this is from Cantoon, and it has avocado hydrating repair leave-in so this was what i used last night and to be honest i'm gonna get myself one i don't know how much <gasps> this is seven dollars wow because honestly how it got my hair feeling last night when i was like really doing my twist outs it got me i got my hair feeling very hydrated i use this indian herb grease from softy soft soft I don't this is indian herb grease and what i like about it is it got and i also got like little herbs in it too if y'all can see it i use on my hair when i'm doing my twist outs and also i use it when i'm um touching my hair in general when i'm touching my hair i get a little scoop of this put it in my hands rub it together and as i'm doing whatever to my hair i put it on my hair see i use this for twist outs too so when i'm done detangling my hair get this scoop my hand boom, boom and i also use this do grow do grow triple strength yeah i use also this do with green what this do this do grow I use this and I put this directly on my scalp when I'm doing my twist outs I only use this when I'm doing my twist outs so when I'm doing my twist outs I and I'm taking a let's say I'm taking a section I grease that part of the section of my like I grease the scalp of that section and I oh I use this oil yes I'm using a lot of oil on my hair cuz it needs that food it needs all this food I call this food for my hair basically because my hair eats up a lot of this so yeah I use this oil you get this from the beauty supply store I use this I put this all over my hands too. rub it but won't put it all over my hands and I got this from 99 cent store also got this from 99 cent store as well and I got this from the beauty supply store so I use all this for my twist so when I'm doing like puffs 
and stuff like this i use i only use this for my edges in here i use this for my edges in here my edge booster to sleek it to do the sleek but for moisturizing it oh my gosh like to keep the moisture in my hair i use Shushay! this olive oil leave in pudding hair pudding is a hair pudding so it's good to like easily style your hair because my hair is thick so it needs that good like setting moisturizer to keep me from not going crazy on my hair always keep a water bottle a water bottle a water spray um a tip put um some of your oils inside the water so while you're doing your water i mean so while you're spraying it in your hair this is the way to go i hope you guys enjoy my video i hope this helped you guys in your hair journey so guys please like comment subscribe you know if you're part of the gang and i'll see you guys on my next one bye